Hello dear students, welcome to the chapter Kingdom Plantae. Students, in this module, we are just going to discuss about the introduction part. Let's start. Students, the entire plant kingdom is broadly divided into various kind of components. Let's see its component. The very first picture that I want to show you is of wall walks and they are included into a category which is known as algae. Okay, let's see what is next. What you can see in the picture? Some leaf like structure. Yes, and they are included into a category which is known as bryophytes. All right. So students, you must be aware of the term ferns. You must have seen in the jungles or forests, isn't it? So they are included into a category which is known as pteridophytes. All right. Students, you must be visiting various uh, gardens. Yes. Have you seen this picture earlier? Well, this is a picture of cycus and they are included into a category which is known as gymnosperms. Fine. And last but not the least, look at the beautiful picture of the orchid students. Yes. And they are included into a category which is very well known as angiosperms. Fine. So students, so far we have seen that the plant kingdom is divided into various kind of components and they are algae, bryophytes, pteridophytes, gymnosperm and angiosperms. Well, so we have seen that the plant kingdom is various component, isn't it? So let's see what is the position of the algae, bryophytes, pteridophytes, gymnosperms and angiosperms. Let's see what is next. Students, the entire plant kingdom is broadly divided into two groups and they are the cryptogamae or cryptogams which are non-flowering plants and phanerogamae or phanerogams which are flowering and seed bearing plants. Well students, when I say there are seed bearing plants, there are two possibilities. The seed may not be included or enclosed within the fruit as you can see in the gymnosperms and the example is cycas just now we have seen, isn't it? And another example is Christmas tree. Well, so there is the second category which is known as angiospermae. In this case, the seed is enclosed within the fruit. Well, you can see the seed in mango, guava, isn't it? So they all are the angiosperms. So students, the cryptogamae which are further divided into thallophyta, bryophyta and pteridophyta. So students, in our coming module, we are just going to discuss about the thallophyta or algae. So students, as you can see, we have just completed the introduction and classification of plant kingdom. See you in next module.